Uh-oh, Twitch got some people fired today. Today I shared with Twitch employees that we've made the difficult decision to reduce the size of our workforce, which results in us having to say goodbye to just over 400 people. Don't, isn't this a company of like 3,000 employees or 2,000? How many do they have right now? How many Twitch employees? 1,800 employees? 1,100 employees? Holy shit. They just fired like a quarter? Of their employees? <clears throat> our mission at Twitch is to empower our communities to create together. You rely on us to give you the tools to build your community, stream your professions uh, safely, and make money doing what you love. We take the responsibility incredibly seriously and sometimes need to make extremely hard decisions to ensure we protect our business in order for Twitch to be on for a long time. Like many companies are, this has been impacted by the current macroeconomic environment and user and revenue growth has not kept pace with the expectations. In order to run our business sustainably, we made the difficult decision to shrink the size of our workforce. Millions of streamers choose to, like, it's so wild to me that like their moderation team is actively destroying the website. I don't, this is like, I feel like Twitch is actually hitting the SJW trope of like, wokeness is ruining your business. Like unironically, um, like the Aiden Ross shit, the Speed shit, the Gideon shit, the Destiny shit. I'm smaller than the, some of these guys, but like Jesus, how could you moderate away just on your moderation team? It's not because of site features. It's not because of products. It's not because of discoverability or user base or financials or anything like that. It was literally just moderation. You like is driving away a massive fucking community of people from your site. It's actually fucking wild. How do you lose Aiden Ross from your site? The guy was pulling like fifty to one hundred thousand viewers. I think Dan Clancy. Do you think the CEO leaves in like a year? I heard that it's a business strategy sometimes where. Once you're old, you, you're, you get rid of your old CEO, you bring in a new one. He does a bunch of unpopular shit that everybody hates him for, and then you toss that one, and then you bring in another CEO to do it. I've heard this is a thing, like a Fall Guy CEO. I heard they did this with Ellen, whatever the fuck, that one girl um, for Reddit. I don't know how common this is for business strat, but. DEI surplus employees are being fired all over the industry, not just Twitch. That is true. A lot of companies are doing layoff. Hell yeah, they are. Meta, fire these fucking employees. Every time they toss another 500 employees, I get another 5% increase in my portfolio. Yes, I am all in on Meta. My portfolio allocation is 150% on Meta. That's right. I took out loans. Okay? Hell yes. Let us go. We're going to the moon. Who bought with me? And where are the doubters in chat, okay? All the doubters in chat that said that this stock wasn't going to pay off for me when it was in the shitter, when this stock was trading for less than $100 a share, and you guys were like, oh, Destiny's a dumb fuck. Now who's laughing? Now who's laughing? Three months, I think, and I can sell this shit. I'm going to sell it at two twenty dollars a share. It's going to happen. Fuck you guys. Are you in the green yet? I'm, I'm like fucking $20,000 in the green. I'm massive in the green, but I got away from my long terms, baby. All right, bye. Remember to hit that like and subscribe, and don't forget the notification bell so that my videos show up right in your feed. Wow. <sighs>